Good afternoon my friends and thank you for coming to visit me for another shave. Today we're using a new soap to me. It's a Razor Rock uh, Blue, I think Blue Barbershop. I noticed this time that they've removed the what the puck off of the front. They may have been offending people. So I think they've just gone with Razor Rock Blue. This is a, uh, from the web page, um, this and the aftershave are tributes to uh, Blue Floyd, which hasn't been around for a long time. Um, and that's a, what do they say the scent notes were? I wrote it on the back of the bottle. I was cheating. Uh, scent notes are uh, bergamot, lemon, lavender, and baby powder. We could put it squarely in the uh, barbershop um, realm of, of scents. Wife unit likes it. So that uh, pretty much makes it the uh, choice of the day. In addition, today, also I received in the mail from from uh, Ben. Uh, I got the uh, the uh, I dare you to try it comb, uh, razor. Uh, it's a seven o'clock made in England so it's it's a kind of like a uh, tech but it's good that the the, uh, the uh, handle goes up nice and tight so where I think it's going to be real real aggressive I don't think it's going to be any less dangerous I'm going into it with that frame of mind uh, and I'll do a couple passes with it I don't have a lot of whiskers because I got a, such a good shave last time that uh, I probably should not have tried to time compress it. But my software will only go two times or double the speed. I should have gone four or five times and then I could have played like uh, Benny Hill kind of music, you know, and really have a good time with it. But that didn't happen. So I'm back to this regular speed me I was at uh, out and got my hair cut today Barbara cut trimmed my mustache too and I would, she says you want me to trim your mustache I says well be careful and he took it all off look at this my handlebars are extinct so I'm gonna have to start all over again they were starting to interfere with the mask anyway, so I guess they needed trimmed. But they trimmed the trimmed it back a little more cruelly than I would have liked. He also trimmed my eyebrows. He didn't even ask if I if I curled my if I had waxed it before I went in. Maybe that would have been different, but. I didn't, so he didn't. This puts me in good conformance with the CDC uh, guidelines of uh, facial hair styles that will go well with their protective masks in case the zombie apocalypse should come and uh, we need to protect ourselves from gaseous fumes or something I don't know I uh, do a little hunting around on the on the uh, shape and cadre site uh, I posted a, a reprint of one of their publications I thought it was pretty humorous I'm not even sure if it's real but it's real enough looking at that it looks like something the feds would do it's just dumb enough well, here we go with this, with fear and trembling. I keep talking because I'm wanting to avoid this, but it's going to have to happen sooner or later. I think. And then, you know, I might not, you know. I'm not afraid. Not very much. I'm gonna shiver me timbers.
you keep if you keep your touch light I'm using a Wizomet blade it has five shades on it maybe six take your time be ginger careful I feel I may be irritating my skin a little bit, but there's no hull plate damage yet. This is just essentially a horizontal shavette. Oh shoot, gotta do my chin yet. Pass one is through. I don't see any hull plate damage. No uh, visible signs of precious bodily fluids leaking. I got a little bit of a irritation spot right here. But there's no leakage. I'll just have to watch that spot. I'm gonna do two passes today. I don't have the nerve to do much more than that. This soap is real nice. It, it is a total barbershop scent. The, the baby powder is pretty dominant. As I found with a lot of the uh, older barbershop scents, there is a baby baby powder note. Anyway, we've started searching for a new TV, and we are at Walmart, and they're having sales. I measured the spot that we think we'd like to put it at. And I've got room for up to a 55 inch TV over the fireplace. The fireplace has straight sides and it's all plastered. It's a little taller than I'm equipped to uh, install it, so I'm going to pay them to install the TV. They have an installation service. And we were looking at a brand called HTC. It gets seems to get real good reviews all over. And uh, it has a uh, rudimentary computer built into it, so it can stream uh, like Roku and uh, some of the online services like YouTube and YouTube TV which we use so it'll eliminate a little bit of rat nest of wiring in front of the or behind the TV where it is now and when we put it up on the wall, it'll gain us two shelves. I took out a shelf in the shelving unit, which is next to the fireplace. I'd almost have to show you, but it's too big of a wreck in there for me to do that. 
because I've been clearing it out, getting it ready. That's not bad at all. I'll do two. I've got enough lather here for one more pass. I'm going to use the, the good old the good old vector go over the spots where I usually have extra hair well there we go gentlemen two passes with no base plate and then one kind of just to kind of clear things up I'm gonna clean up a little bit more around here maybe I'll do a little soaking like I enjoyed that so much last time I'm not equipped for mammoth painting but I'll certainly anoint my face with this uh, lather and get a little nourishment in there We'll be back in just a moment. Sharp, feel sharp. Be sharp and listen, mister. How are you fixed for blades? You do have blades. How are you fixed for blades? You better check. Please make sure you have enough. Cause a worn out blade makes shaving mighty tough. How are you fixed for blades? Welcome back and thank you for waiting. Sorry about the wiggle there. I got a little overzealous touching the button. Today's shave was brought to you by uh, Razor Rocks uh, Blue, a uh, tribute to Blue Floyd, a barbershop scent with uh, kind of a florally, powdery kind of fragrance that Dwight likes. So we are there. Um, we used the soap. We used, I didn't mention today, we used a, this is from Frank Shaving. It's a, there's a user group on Facebook called Friendship Shaving. And this is their 2019 brush. Its name is Macy. So she sits there. And this was the uh, Daredevil Shave. We used a uh, English made tech called uh, the 7 o'clock. At least that's what I feel like that it should be. Using a Wizomet blade and the cap only. It seems like it'll be a it would be a nice nice razor. Um, even without like having aversion to open combs. I've had uh, them bite me a few times and it wasn't very pleasant but we will maybe revisit that and we'll decide who gets this next either it goes back to KJ and thank you for uh, making this available uh, KJ is also you'll find him on the shaving cadre he's one of our big drivers on the on the uh, uh, do it if you dare shaves and and uh, other kind of neat stuff. He likes to eat hot peppers, uh, which some of us aren't real good at. I tried last year. I did get as high as a, what was that, habanero I did last year. I generally don't like hot food much, and I still don't, but I did the you know, habanero because reasons. Um, so that's all we have for today's shave. I am Major Richie. You will find me on the Shaving Cadre. Please come and visit us. Have a great time, and I hope you'll stay, and uh, we will see you next time. Bye-bye.